What is the easiest way to create an interactive dashboard in Python? Hello everyone, my name is Sophia. I am a data scientist. Previously, my friend Mark and I wrote this article on how to create an interactive dashboard in Python. In this video, I'd like to show you step-by-step step how to create this interactive dashboard using hvplot. hvplot was developed by my Anaconda colleagues, Philip Rudiger, John Luke Stevens, and Jim Bender. It's the same as the familiar pandas.plot API, but using .hvplot instead to give you richly interactive plots in a web browser. In my experience, this is the easiest way to create interactive plots in Python for pandas, task, and X-ray data frames. hvplot is one of the standard libraries in the Holoviz ecosystem. If you'd like to learn more about Holoviz, check out my previous video on why I love Holoviz so much. Okay, let's get started on making this dashboard. Here is the GitHub repo for this video. I will link in the description below. You can follow this video by either cloning this repo or opening up the Binder app or Colab linked in the GitHub repo. To show you how this works on your local machine, I'm going to start from scratch. First, if you haven't installed Anaconda or Miniconda already, please install those first. You can install those following the instructions on the Anaconda website. Then you should be able to use conda in your command line. If you prefer, you can also use pip, but I recommend conda. And let's create a new conda environment. Activate this environment and then install the packages we need. Conda install hvplot, panel, pandas, JupyterLab. Then I can open up a JupyterLab or you can open up your Jupyter Notebook and start coding. First, we need to import needed modules. Let's import panel, load the tabular extension. It will allow us to display and edit a pandas data frame. Let's also import hvplot.pandas. It is the hvplot plotting extensions for pandas. Import hollow views and specify using bokeh as the backend. Next, we can define some color palette for our plots and dashboard. Then we load a sample data from Bokeh. I'm using the auto MPG data here. Here's what our sample data looks like. Imagine that you want to process this data with the following pandas data processing pipeline. That we would like to select a subset of this data based on the values of the cylinders and the manufacturer. And then we would like to calculate the mean values of horsepower for each origin, cylinder, manufacturer, and year. What if we would like to turn the number of cylinders, CYL, the name of the manufacturer, FMR, and the variable horsepower, HP, into interactive widgets that we can change and control? Is it possible? Yes, it is. And with hvplot, it is super easy. Here are the steps. First, we need to wrap our data frame with dot interactive, IDF equals DF dot interactive, so that this data frame becomes interactive and we can use panel widgets on this data frame. Dot interactive basically stores a copy of your pipeline and dynamically replace the pipeline whenever that widget changes. Second, we can define the panel widgets we like to use. Panel widgets let you control parameter values. Here, I define a panel widget for cylinders, a widget for manufacturer, and a widget to select the variables of interest. Here, I call it y-axis. Finally, we can combine the pipeline and the widgets by replacing the values or variables from the original pandas pipeline to those widgets we just defined. We define the output of the pipeline as i-pipeline, interactive pipeline. Similar to a pandas data frame, our interactive data frame supports the dot pipe method so that we can pipe a function or class such as the tabular widget into this data frame. The result shows an interactive table. The interactive data frame iPipeline just works like a normal pandas data frame when it comes to plotting. We can use our normal dot plot method, or here I tried my favorite plotting method dot hvplot using hvplot and magically our plot becomes interactive. Now that we have a plot, a table, and three widgets, how do we arrange them into a dashboard? Here we use a template to arrange our widgets into the sidebar and add our plot and table into the main body of the dashboard. 
we use the panel here to make those panel objects. To check how your dashboard looks like, we can simply run .show. To launch this dashboard as a web server, use .servable, and then go to a terminal, simply run panel serve, and then the file name of your notebook or your Python file. And your browser should now open up with a tab showing this dashboard. That's all it takes. Super easy. If you'd like to deploy your dashboard to Google Cloud, check out my previous videos on how to deploy a dashboard to Google Cloud App Engine and Google Cloud Run. Check out Panel's documentation on server deployment if you would like to deploy it into other servers. I will link all of my references and learning resources in the description below. Hope you enjoy using HPplot.interactive. See you in my next video. Thank you. Bye.